Hello everybody. Today we're going to work on the aft top skin and consequently the harness attach bracket, the aft deck and the static air. In the previous video we worked on the static ports as you can see. They're placed right over there. And before we're going to close the aft deck, the, the top side, we the top skin, we are going to route the static air tube from the uh, right side to the left side around the bulkhead and all the way up to the front. We cannot put the, the tube against the longeron yet because we need to rivet that. So that's why we uh, just cut it off there and, and start working on other stuff. So before I'm going to rivet the top skin, I want to do the off deck. I delay this a lot because I wanted to pull the, the black um, wire tube that you can see there all the way aft so uh, that took me a while but now it's there so now we can finally rift the off deck with the off deck you get a you kind of keep the both the longerons uh, in the correct situation so there's no twist anymore so it's a very you have to very carefully um, measure the uh, the longerons to get it straight. If you screw this up, your fuselage might be kind of twisted, and that's of course not good. It will definitely impact flying. Okay, with all the rivets set, as you can see, some are very hard to reach. It was okay. There are some uh, some doublers in there for the elevators. And uh, yeah, they look nice. So with those riveted, we can now uh, start with the uh, F top skin. So I decided that uh, we first click everything together, but I decided not to, to do it like this because then you have to work from inside. So somebody has to, let's say, lay into the, the fuselage. That doesn't sound very comfortable to me. So what I did is, what I decided is that we will just see how far we can get uh, by just reaching in. And you can see also from the back side. Uh, that's why of course you can route the static air tube right now and then open it up and do the rest and this worked actually quite good we started on the um, the left side because the static air tube uh, is routed to the forward uh, on the on the left side so that's how we started there the harness is uh, connected with a steel uh, cable to a, a bracket which is attached to the longerons so once you have riveted everything you can install that if you install it first then the the nuts and bolts of that attached bracket would prevent you from riveting it so that's why you do it now I drill an extra hole so I can attach the um, the tube uh, to it so it won't uh, let's say shave against uh, the metal and now we can route it to the forward. Okay, with that done, we can now um, clico a little bit further. Still, I need to be able to reach it in. Oh, actually, I think I make a mistake there because I I riveted something which I shouldn't, which you will see in a later video because uh, I riveted the bulkhead top. You shouldn't do that. I'll I'll get back to it later. Okay, so now we click a little bit further and and now I can reach in every time and uh, buck the uh, the rivet. So it works good, as you can see. It actually worked much better than I thought. And you can actually go um, quite far, as you can see. It's not that hard. 
so that went okay. The last part is of course trickier because there is a point where you can no longer reach in. That was here, so you have to close it. But at least, uh, yeah, you can book it from from over there. You can reach in. Quite good, actually. And the rest you can do from the from the the aft side through the um, through the last bulkhead, which is probably better not to uh, to put it in. You can do it later. So that, uh, that I think that's 709 or maybe 710. Maybe you should not do it. I mean, the holes are big enough. You can get through it, but it's not very handy. Let's put it that way. And you'll probably cut your arm, hands on it. So now we have to do the, the right bracket, the harness attached bracket. And again, as you can see, you can just reach everything. If two persons is doable, if, you're, if you have to do it on your own, it's, then, then it will be very hard. I have a torque wrench, so my dad holds the the bottom side, and I can use a torque wrench to, to torque up the, um, the bolts. Right, finished. Continuing building my pie in the sky.